Alright lads, I was up late thinking to myself about how Spurs lost to Wolves twice and thought, thank god F1 is starting so I have something to distract me from being a Spurs fan. Then I came up with my second ever good idea. Instead of spending ages trying to make horrible predictions for this 2024 season, I could just let F1 23 do it for me. So let me show you how it's all gonna work. That is right lads, we are back at the start of the 2023 season. We haven't even had the car reveal yet, but as you can see, I'm on Aston Martin. I replaced the glorious Lance Stroll, I'm sorry about that. I'm sure he will be missed. As you can see, there's me on the left. I am quite obviously Qatari, if you couldn't tell from uh, the videos. Uh, I am worth 50,000 in my market value. It's slightly lower than my teammate, but I'm sure we'll catch up to him eventually. But yes, we are here to simulate the 2024 season. I want to see what this game thinks is going to happen. Man, this car reveal is really awkward about the music. Um... We are now at the end of the 2023 season, so it is not long left until we can start our journey in the 2024 Formula 1 season. I'm kind of curious to see what happened though, because I literally simmed all of it, so I, I got I got two points all season, lads. Okay, it's still better than what Stroll would have done. Hopefully I didn't cause as much damage to the car, but I think we're mainly fine. What a surprise, Verstappen won the Driver Championship. The game successfully predicted the Driver Champion for 2023, I guess. It didn't get the construction one right though. My results weren't that great. I was always off of points. Also, uh, Alonso is retiring at the end of the season, so he won't even be in it for the 2024 season. Also, I forgot to mention, Aston Martin are actually the best car on the grid right now. Like, overall, we, we didn't do very well for having the best car on the grid. And now we can end the season and officially move on to 2024. But remember, Brian, don't touch anything when we're in the future. Even stepping on a Sonoda could create a chain reaction that drastically alters the present. Really? Nah, you can do whatever you want. Come on! Right, there's bound to have been people moving around, so let's check what the game thinks the starting grid for the 2024 season is gonna be. Nope, I was wrong. There was literally no changes in the grid other than Porsche Hera placing Alonso. That's kind of crazy. All right, here we go. The Bahrain Grand Prix, the opening race of the 2024 season. I've actually just realized this video will come out the exact same time this Grand Prix starts in real life. Let's please choose my video over the Grand Prix. At least play it in like the background or something. Get my watch time up. Right, I got an 11th place for the um, the opening race and poor Cher placed higher than me in ninth. We've got the best car on the grid and we're not looking so great. We're gonna have to hope that we're better in the race. So Leclerc on pole, can he convert it to a win? Let's find out. Right, here we go. P11 start. Lights out and away we go! Let's face in the side round with a stab and... No, it's... Ah! Let's not look into that racing incident. Nothing happened there. Right, come on. Can the straight line speed carry me? We're supposed to have some very good straight line speed on this car. A few moments later. We are fast. We are fast. Perez, let me through. Let me through. I'm sure he wasn't happy about that one, but I am. Smooth I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again. I don't care. Oh, that's smooth, that's smooth, smooth operator. He's not gonna be happy about that at all, I'm actually scared, he might take me out. We actually could win this, lads. The simmed version of me does not do very well. Good to know real me is better, though. Kind of surprising, to be, to be fair. Oh no, that was terrible. Science, stay away, please. Hamilton, mate, can you slow down, please? Help me out here, lad, give me some DRS. There is a, um, very angry, enraged science following me. Any DRS would be helpful. Oh my god, Jesus Christ, he's fast. So is Perez, they've got the DRS. Alright, I'm dive bombing you, lads. In absolutely no way am I allowing that. Oh, that was not a good idea. Oh, science is gone. Science is backwards. Oh, Jesus Christ, there's a red flag. Oh, what? What What happened there? No way. They've somehow deemed this a racing incident and given me no penalty. Lights out and away we go for the second time today. And what a start I get pulling off the back of Leclerc. 
Oh, Leclerc is coming around the inside. He's trying to get revenge for his teammate, but it does not work out. I am terrified for my life, though. I'm not sure if Sainz is still in the race or not. I think he is. He's probably going to be hunting me down. At least this gives me motivation to drive fast. I'm basically just running for my life now. I think everybody knows it was my fault. This time next year, Sainz won't even be your teammate anymore. It'll be Hamilton. You don't need to protect him this much. Come on. All right, this is it. The final lap. Perez has now taken second. Look, there he's gone. I can't see him. Perez, you can't win this. You don't deserve to win this. Stay out of this. This is not your fight. Stay back with Russell. Yes, that is a win for me on the opening day of the 2024 season. That win was not deserved, let's be real. I'm out here celebrating like I've just won the World Cup when realistically I should be straight on the bus home to think about what I've done. And the Claire somehow went down to 9th. I'm not sure what happened to him. Verstappen 14th. Oh my god, that is beautiful. I'm actually going to look at the replay and see if I can figure out what happened to the Claire. It still seems fine for him though. He's just kind of driving around like catching up a little bit. Oh! Right, I think we found out what happened to him and the rest of the grid. Jesus Christ. He held up the whole grid. It wasn't me then who ruined everyone's race. It was Leclerc by spinning off in the corner. Right, let's sim a little bit further through the season and then see what's going on around then. Are you okay? That was a nasty hit. Detail could have disastrous consequences. Uh-huh. Tiniest detail. Got it. Now, before you put on any of my costumes, you'll first need to get into this alien skin bodysuit. Alright, let's. I've just come back from my dinner break and we're back in the Aston Martin HQ. This guy is heading home. He's had enough. He has seen enough and decided it's time to leave. Yeah, you know, that's reasonable. Yeah, uh, how you doing, mate? Yep, yeah, you know, yeah, me too. Great, um... Right, here we are, the final race of the season, which is Las Vegas. Because I have a short career, I picked a short career. Because it would take me a long time to simulate the whole career in a full season. But, right, let me get my one-shot qualifying done. Hope I don't bottle it. And then head into the final race of the season, see if we can pick up one last win. You know what, it would be fitting to have the, um, the first game of the season be a win. Pretty terrible performances, the rest of it. And then the last game of the season be a win. I've unfortunately had to find out the hard way that this, this Aston Martin car is not very good on the Las Vegas track. Right, here we are, last race of the season, the last chance to try and get another win on the board. Second win. I've got uh, all of the Aston Martin officials surrounding me. Hello, mate. Right, okay, he's just looked away and I've looked at him. I don't think anyone on my team likes me, but that's an issue for another day. But now we've got the issue of actually trying to win, which is going to be difficult, but for Stappen, got a poor start. I can come through the side and try and die my way in watch out oh that's probably not great it doesn't matter it was all scripted because look, look who it is lads look who's right in front of me it's none other than the smooth operator himself my god could you be any earlier on the brakes mate jesus christ they're so fast this aston martin it's still top of the board i don't understand how we are doing so poorly on this track you know it's probably a me problem let's just ignore it Science, I'm going in. Just leave it. 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 Thank God. I am so surprised you didn't just cut down through the inside and try and murder me. Especially since I don't think you can call that respectful driving from my end. All right. DRS. Overtake. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I can't make that. I am <gasps> no, it's... Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> what the hell? All right. Well, little Lando Norris is out the race. It was all too much for little Lando Norris. Mate, that's such a me thing to do. But you know what? Let's do something reasonable. Let's listen to our suggested strategy and actually pit when they want me to. Right, I'm going into the pits. Science, do not follow me. Oh, Hamilton's following me. Flag. Red flag. What? It was Piastri doing in the wall? It's been a disaster for the McLarens. Jesus. Right, well, I literally just pit, so that was terrible timing. Oh, that's going to give so many people who stayed out with advantage. Oh, you know what? This is actually going to be mad because there's going to be people at the top like Gasly and like Hulkenberg or whatever who didn't pit. There's going to be people who should be at the bottom who are going to have a chance to win this race. Right, EA, you've created a masterclass. Leclerc is in 11th with me in 12th when we should have been 1-2 after everyone else pit. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Lads, let's hurry up. I've got places to be. Porsche is doing me a massive favor here by holding off Perez. Right, I'm going to take... 
I'm gonna take you, Perez. You stay out of this. I'm going with my teammate. I'm not sure how close the championship actually is. I didn't really check, but this this, this red flag could really change everything. Either way, this is a very interesting race now. All right, Porsche, let me through. Let's try and let's try and keep this together. A few moments later. We didn't keep it together. We did not keep it together. I've zoomed away from my teammate. I've pulled him miles out of the DRS. He works so well as a teammate and I completely abandoned him. Ooh, fastest lap. <laughs> oh, you know, Max Verstappen. Verstappen, go jump out of a building. You know what? It's actually a lot closer up here than I thought. The win is still on. Oh my god, Sainz is in first. And Piastri's in second. He was the one who caused the red flag. My place, thank you very much. This red flag might actually have got me a chance to win. Yes, I got the DRS. This is so scripted. This game is so scripted. It's a 1-2 between me and Sainz. We're getting to the end of the race. It could potentially be a battle to the end for me and Sainz for who wins. Oh, we're locking wheels. I'm trying to leave you space, Sainz. Oh, he's hit the wall. There's a caution. There's a yellow flag. Sainz has dropped off. I think Sainz has dropped to like six or something. Oh my God, this game was so scripted to have us fighting each other there. And of course we had to hit each other. Sainz, if you're watching this, don't take this personally, lad. I don't hate you in real life. I'm running out of overtake mode, but we're entering the final corner. I'm in the lead. Piastri is second. They're too far back to make a go for it now. And it's like it was written in the stars. I win the first first race of the 2024 season and the last race. Viva Las Vegas! And there we go, that will conclude the 2024 season in this game. Let's have a look at the final standings and see what the game thinks is actually going to be the final the final championship standings. Alright, so at the bottom on zero points is Logan Sargent. I'm sure everyone is did not expect this. It's a big shock. 19th is Joe. 18th is Daniel Ricciardo. 17th is Kevin Magnussen. 16th is Hulkenberg. 15th is Albon. 14th is Ocon. 13th is Bottas. 12th is Sonoda. 11th is Gasly, 10th is my teammate, 9th is Max Verstappen, 8th is me, 7th is Sergio Perez, 6th is Oscar Piastri, 5th is Lando Norris, 4th is Carlos Sainz, 3rd is Charles de Clare. I kind of thought he was closer to winning, 2nd is George Russell, which means Lewis Hamilton kind of ran away with this championship, and he won the Drivers' Championship. So in his final season at Mercedes before he moves to Ferrari, F123 thinks that Hamilton will will win the Drivers' Championship with them. That's kind of beautiful, EA. So they predict Red Bull to have a massive drop-off, which, you know, I hope is true. We all gotta pray. And if you want to look at the individual race results, here you go. You can pause at any point here and have a look through to see where people finished. But there you go. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel because it helps me out a lot. And let me know down in the comments what other types of videos you want to see. And if you want to see any more F1 content. <laughs>